basically giving assistance without even you ask for it. So for that, I chatted with myself between my two different phones, and uh, I asked myself, well, how are you doing? And then I answered myself, I'm doing great, I watched, a, I watched Tomorrowland movie, it was great, you should see it. Uh, are you up for tonight? dinner tonight? What about 8 p.m. Cascal? And then uh, lower, move this. Lower, lower, I say, okay, by the way, don't forget to submit the paper tomorrow morning. So this is, this is some conversation, which could be very well a conversation between you and a friend, right? And now, the way, the way that this, the way that uh, now on top works is, actually this time is lower side of the page, is that home button. So we're trying to make that home button to be a magic home button. And uh, the, all I need to do is basically I just long press on the home button and I get some, uh, some assistance for what I can do later. Okay, so here, there's a first uh, the part that you see here, it's uh, Tomorrowland, it's the movie which was mentioned in the, uh, in the text. You see that there are some extra, you see there's some information about that, some uh, short card, but also some more interesting stuff which is those apps which you see uh, lower there. So these are apps which I have installed on my, on my uh, mobile and I can do the next uh, actions if I want uh, with them. So if now I click on uh, Flickster for example, I go exactly on the page in Flickster which is talking about uh, Tomorrowland. So that's basically making my trajectory from a chat to, to, that, uh, to that app very easy and uh, fast. So lower, I see another car, which is Cascal, the restaurant which I talked about. And, uh, and again, a series of things which is there, Yelp and Open Table. I'll come back to this because I want to continue. And, uh, and finally, there is another part which is add a reminder. And if I press on this last one, it just opens the UI of reminder with already tomorrow morning uh, mentioned there. So basically, trying to understand the natural language uh, sentences which was in the, in the chat, and then try to understand that this is potentially what, uh, what user might want. So you show, you basically prepare all these parts, and then we make them to be very easily, basically based on tabs, you can do the next steps that you want to do. So now let's take one of them, uh, Caspel, and then continue uh, working on that, uh, that uh, task. So I will press on Yelp. Now I am on, uh, let's bring it down. This is a Cascal on Yelp, right? So again, note that no copy paste, that all I needed to do, long press and tap on Yelp. So I, I end up exactly on the right page that I wanted to be on Yelp. So here on Yelp, there is no uh, button for reservation here for Cascal. So if I want to make a reservation, I have to do, Use my magic home button. So now I have, in addition to that list, I also have check out the program open table there. So uh, I can press on open table. Now I moved from Yelp to another app, which is for your restaurant reservation in the US. I think it may be in some other countries too. And uh, let's uh, actually do the reservation. I tap on eight, and I tap on reserve, and that's all I needed to do. So look how smooth and how fast was a real life task uh, completion. I, I was in a chat, I just tapped and tapped and tapped, and then I managed to make a reservation. I saw a review on the bay, I moved from, from, uh, from Viber to, uh, from Viber to uh, Yelp, and from Yelp to OpenTable, and I actually ended up to really beat that reservation. I should cancel it. But um, and and all all in all during all this time, my Google Assistant was with me and was helping me to make this uh, this uh, transition to be faster and easier. Okay, that was my last demo. Sorry.